Good evening. Dan Fitzpatrick here, StockMarketMentor.com, and I got just a real quick one for you, uh, Penny Mac Financial. Here's why. Um, this is a stock, um, the stock of the company that actually does really, really well. I mean, this is a, a company that has great uh, profit margins and expanding revenue and earnings um, over the last few quarters. So there's a lot to like about um, this company and a lot to like about this stock. I've been tracking this. It's on uh, one of my uh, lists of stocks that I keep and then I look at every day and today is the day. Today is the day. Um, the blue line 200 day moving average and you can see it's been capping the stock for a while but finally we get a breakout today. Um, volume was less than average over the last 50 days but you see all that volume back there so like let's say we change it to 20 uh, 20 days to take out of the equation all this volume um, you know all this volume during this big volatile period here and then suddenly you get uh, volume that's above the typical average volume again just like from the last uh, from the last month or so this is what we like to see in a volatility expansion trade so this is what you're doing you know you're buying there's plenty of liquidity uh, almost 800,000 shares traded today but you're buying the stock here on the breakout and then I would keep a stop uh, a little bit below this 200 day moving average. You keep, give it about uh, six and a half percent, something like that. And my bet is if you make that trade, you give it six and a half percent of room on the downside. Uh, you're probably going to do pretty, pretty uh, well. Um, did I just say pretty, pretty well? OK, OK. Um, you're probably well, I know why I was saying that, uh, because you're probably going to make at least two um, times what you were risking. In other words, you're risking six and a half. Uh, I would look for like a 13% price target. And that's how I would trade uh, Penny Mac. Um, members, in the strategy session, I'm giving you the stats on our growth stock list trades. Those are the ones where I'm giving you specific entries, stop placements, and exits. Our numbers are really good. I'll just leave it there. So you should be making plenty of money if you're tracking and following those trades.